We are uh, excited to say the least. I, I give our guys a ton of credit. You know, I think in preparing for this season, you know, we've had we have a lot of goals every year when getting ready. And this year, the number one goal is to stay healthy, and it's virus free. So we've actually, we haven't spent a second indoors. We've been practicing outside. We were on the football field, plowing it slash shoveling it. Uh, you know, if the wind chill was, was 10 degrees or higher, we were outside. And uh, our guys haven't registered a single complaint. They've embraced it. Um, they've, uh, they've done a really good job. You know, we've been going, obviously we, we have to, we're slaves to daylight, so we have to we have to uh, make sure we're doing it during daylight. So guys are coming in between their classes in small groups. You know, we'll have three or four infields at a time, five pitchers at a time, things like that. They've been diligently getting their work done. I mean, it, I just, I can't say enough about our guys' effort, their attitudes through this. And I, I think it's gonna really help us moving forward. You know, baseball, especially in the spring, you have to be flexible. You have to be able to perform in circumstances that aren't necessarily ideal. And uh, if anybody's going to be prepared to do that, I think it's going to be going to be our guys. So we're excited, you know, with how we've prepared. I think uh, we're more excited to see if it worked and, and and how that unfolds. But we've also been on our field on Nobby's ballpark for the last couple of weeks. Once once things uh, the snow melted in the outfield, obviously with the turf, we've been out there and getting a lot of a lot of game like situations in things like that. So it's been uh, it's been a very interesting, a chilly, but also a very productive. Uh, time to prepare here and we can't wait to get on the field Saturday the guys are really fired up about it obviously with COVID it's been a struggle but you know what we've really been putting in the hours we were out there in the snow on the football field and the baseball field is covered um, yeah we've definitely been putting in the work we're really excited to get out there um, we've been facing each other we're really dying to face some other competition um, it's getting a little repetitive out here but we're super excited for this week um, like I said we've, we've really been grinding out there I feel really good about the team and we're, we're looking pretty damn good um, and just overall, very excited to get back out there. It's been it's been a long year. Um, just really excited for my last year. It's a, it's it's going to be a good one. As far as what we expect from our guys, you know, a lot of that is going to be energy, hunger. You know, those things are are I think innate in any base college athlete, college baseball player. But you know, if, if those are amplified because of the circumstances, so be it. I, you know, I, I'm not too worried about our motivation, our our energy. I would expect us to make some aggressive mistakes. Um, but also be into it and, and be excited and to go out there with a real you know, passion for, for playing and for winning. I, that's been the message that we've conveyed once or twice this past week was, you know, we're gonna be really excited to play, but, but we can't lose sight of the fact that we're out there to win games. And uh, the excitement has to be, you know, kind of turned into focus and drive. And uh, that's not something I'm worried about with our group. They're very focused kids. They're, they're here to win and, and to play for championships. So I'm not necessarily worried about it, but how that manifests is gonna be into a lot of excitement and a lot of passion and, and, and hopefully joy uh, playing together, winning together. As far as our opponent, you know, I don't have much of a scouting report. The last time we played Hiram, I think it was in 2008. Uh, and uh, we haven't played him since. They have a new, a new coach. He's, this is the second or third year. He's a good guy, young guy. I'm friends with him. He, he's gonna come out. He's gonna have his guys ready to play. So we're excited. I don't, I don't think it matters if it's Hiram or if it's uh, the Cleveland Indians that we're playing against. We're gonna come out, you know, like gangbusters and and uh, give it all we've got. So we're excited for the weekend to say the least, and and uh, you know, fired up for the chance to play and, and win.